All right, YouTube, so we're back with another video today. And basically today we're going to be painting my wheels again. I did them about maybe a little over a year ago. I painted them when I still had my tile, so over, over a year ago, obviously. And today, uh, right now they're about a matte black. They're matte. And they really don't match the truck. They do. They're black. They match the truck, but... I went out, I bought some gloss black. I got two cans, that should be enough for four wheels. Basically, I'm gonna just sand them down real quick, paint them, and hopefully they look better. They look good, Matt, but I think they look better gloss. It kind of matched the truck a little bit better. And I'm gonna, I got the other three right there. I need to pull those out because I already had this one out because I blew my tire over the winter and my dad had to bring me a tire, so we get through this one on. So, I'm grab my tripod, I'll pull them wheels out. And we'll start to sand them down. All right, so basically, I'm just going to take this um abrasive pad and i'm gonna sand down the wheel so i'll just time lapse that because i feel like everyone's sand down if you're painting your wheels you've done something like this before and i also got to paint all the caps too because they're just the same color as the other wheels and i also have these white um letters on here which i don't know i might just take a sharpie honestly and cover them up because i don't like the way it looks so i'm just gonna time lapse me sand down the wheel I'm only going to show one. I'm going to show all of them. And I'm going to sand the back and the front. And then I got, I think I got some cleaner that I'll just clean the wheels with down. Put some on the floor and then we'll paint them. now after the whole wheel sanded right got to clean it before the paint so for the back of the wheels i'm really not trying to make them look perfect so basically you put in 90 percent of the effort you're gonna get or you put 70 percent of the effort you're gonna get 90 percent of the look if you want that 100 percent look you got to put that extra 30 percent, which takes the most so basically um just take some type of cleaner i got some mineral spirits right here which is honestly not the best i don't know it just slow evaporation so it takes forever I'm going to go through, I'm going to tape off um, around the hub so there's no paint on there. I'm going to uh, clean this and I'll come right back with you. All right, now you see the wheel is pretty clean. It's still dirty. It's all stained. I'm really not trying to make it perfect. I just want, when you see through these holes through the other side of the barrel, it just, it's not just dirty. It's, it has some black paint, but mainly going to be focused on my paint here, just around. You can kind of see overspray from before, but it really just going to be focusing down here and it's his lips. Not trying to be too bad. I was going to tape off the wheels around the edge or the tire, but I don't know. I'm just going to try my best not to get so much paint. You're never going to see this side. And obviously taped off the hub, no paint on there. We'll flip the wheel over. I'll clean the other side and then I'll put um, some tape around the valve stem. All right, you guys can see wheel is done. It's all um, taped off. Put some tape. I'll show you how to use the postcards cleaned and basically just do the same thing on all four wheels and then obviously you'll paint All right, so obviously they're not perfect. They're still 
paint on the tires. But they're the back, so these will probably be... The coat is pretty good, I see, I feel like. So this is probably the only coat. Go through, I'll pull this tape off. And, well, right now we're going to... These are already sanded, so we'll clean them, and we'll go tape off um, all the little bolts. All right, so basically clean taped so i'll paint these which is you know just paint normally how you paint everything else just make sure you're around get around the edges and then i'll pull this tape off and flip them over and we'll start on those all right so basically so they're looking on only problem i had was a few little runs right there I just kind of wiped them with my finger but so you see how all these cards are so basically you just go around you just stick them in the lip of the wheel and just do that the whole way around it's very simple and if you're doing this outside this can be a bitch because they do blow around any little wind will blow them over so basically i'm gonna finish this wheel off you just stick them in the lip nice and easy please see how the rest So that's what they look like after you can see there's a little bit of trash in them dust but i'm in a garage there's nothing i can really do about that but after the first coat they're looking pretty good coverage was decent all right so basically i'm gonna let that dry for like 15 minutes probably let it dry and i did do a second pass on these and um probably let them dry for 15 minutes do another coat after i did kind of the heavy coat so i wasn't too light but i didn't so I'll let that dry. So second coat is done. Looking really good, except for this wheel. I don't know what's going on right here, but I don't know, it's like bubbling up. I have no clue. And I think it's doing it just a little bit right here, yeah. I don't know, it's never happened before. So I'm just gonna let that fully dry figure out after so be back in a minute with this dry so basically it's a week later the wheels are on the truck and i just put tires on i'm about to show you them so they've been on the truck for a week i never ended up putting a third coat on them i don't know i just never did um they're on i would have recorded last week when i put them on but it was cold outside and it rained all week so now I just washed the truck, everything's clean. If you see what I'm wearing now, this, and then a few videos after this, same clothes are on, because recording the same day. But I'll go out there, I'll show you what it look like, and honestly, they actually do look good. You can definitely see a little imperfections in them, but they look good, so I'll show you right now. <laughs> Fit the truck well. Formed in. It's a lot more shady on this side, so you can't really tell, but still do look really good. All right, so basically that's gonna finish out that video. Um, painting my wheels. They look pretty good, I would say. Maybe in a few weeks or a few months. Probably not a few months, but a few weeks I'll go through, pull them off. I'll paint them one more time i'll sand them down this time paint them and maybe clear coat them in a few weeks just uh make them look a little bit better but that's the end of that video and
Hope you liked it. It's not necessarily a tutorial, but basically how I did it. I know it's, people are going to be like, it's not the right way to do this, this is, but oh well. It's done. It looks good. So peace. See you in the next video.